Eric, um, could you just give us an update on your squad and who's available, particularly Luke Shaw, Rasmus Hoyland, and also Manuel Ugarte, given his international. <coughs> Um, uh, Rasmus Hoyland and Luke Shaw, they are progressing very well, but not, not ready for this game. Uh, Manuel Gata, uh, I think we all have seen, um, he, he played uh, for Uruguay. Um, he returned this afternoon, he was the only player who returned today. Uh, all the other players returned yesterday. Um, yeah, so he is available for this game. Um, Cristiano Ronaldo has. Uh has voiced his opinion on Manchester United to Rio Ferdinand and one of the things that he said was um, you can't say that you can't win the Premier League at Manchester United. What is your view of that and can Manchester United win the Premier League? He, he said that, that Manchester United can't win the Premier League. No, he said that you No, he, he said this. <laughs> if you read the article very well. So... So he's far away from Saudi, uh, or far away from Manchester. Uh, so uh, everyone can have, and he's entitled to have an opinion. It's okay. Are you confident then that the club are on the right track? Because obviously there's been a couple of difficult results and in a row of difficult performances. There's pressure building all the time at this at this place. So are you confident things are going the right way? It's we will see where we are in in May next year. It's um, very early in the season. And yeah, it's about winning trophies, be as high as possible, of course, in the league, um, uh, do everything to win every game. Um, yeah. And then we will see in May where we are and then judge. When there's a lot of noise, obviously the international break, there's a lot of noise. How does it impact you? Do, do you block it out? I mean, how do you deal with it? Because in it doesn't impact me. I know in the process where we are and what we have to do. Where we are going, I have said before, we are still in a transition period. We have to, to integrate a lot of young players also in, in the team. We are still dealing with, with injuries. We have to bring the injuries back in the team. And um, before anyone thinks uh, about excuses, no, we have to win every game. I know that, the team knows this, and it doesn't matter who are available, and yeah, we will focus on every game and have in every game the mindset we have to win. Eric, I spoke to Diogo Dallo this afternoon and he said that there was a frustration in him and amongst some of the players that what you've been able to show at the start of this season isn't truly reflective of what's going on in the training pitches every single day. He believes that what's happening here at the club now is, is it, it's in a good place and that things are better than it's been in recent times. Do you agree with that? Do you feel like the team are really onto something now and that will show in time and the results. Oh, when, of course, when you see uh, the scores, no one is happy. Uh, but also players uh, have a very good sense of the process, of the quality of the process. Yeah, and I agree with him. We are, and also when you analyse the games, um, all the games so far, uh, we are in a good direction. Uh, but also, uh, but as normal in the transition period and in the period where you have to build the team, we have to improve, we have to step up. What do you think is different then that, that Diogo is, is feeling and that, that you're seeing that gives you that belief that this season can be better than what's gone before? Well, we, have, we have good characters, you, you feel the team spirit and now it's about to get the patterns and the routines in. Uh, once we have that, everyone sees the quality we have on the training pitch. Eric, you've got a tough period coming up with seven games in the next 22 days. What do you want to see from your team between now and the next international break? And, and given the last couple of results, is this game at Southampton a game you have to win? We have to win all the games. And that is, will always be the approach. It doesn't change for any game.